Hiring for your small business? If you're not looking for professionals on LinkedIn, you're looking in the wrong place. That's like looking for your car keys in a fish tank. LinkedIn helps you hire professionals you can't find anywhere else. Even those who aren't actively searching for a new job but might be open to the perfect role. In a given month, over 70% of LinkedIn users don't even visit other leading job sites. So start looking in the right place. With LinkedIn, you can hire professionals like a professional. Post your free job on linkedin.com slash achieve today. It's time for Tuesday Terror here on the Mutual Audio Network. The following audio drama is rated R and is recommended restricted for anyone under the age of 17. ACAST powers the world's best podcasts. Here's a show that we recommend. Nature. I've got a gay rooster named Francois. Is so gay. These rams are gay. I'm studying gay animals. Does that mean I'm gay? So why don't more people know this? I'm Owen Ever. I'm Lane Kaplan-Levinson. And this is a field guide to gay animals. A podcast about queerness in the natural world. The animal kingdom is queer. And we are apart. Find a field guide to gay animals on Spotify, Apple, or wherever you get your podcasts. ACAST helps creators launch, grow, and monetize their podcasts everywhere. ACAST.com. We're alive. Gold Rush. Chapter 2. Bushwhacker. Written, directed, and produced by K.C. Whalen. Previously on We're Alive. Gold Rush. Is this what you want to talk about? Stories about my dad? A bar of fucking gold? It's real! And the paper said there were 3,000 of these things. Uh, follow, follow the map. Hello? Hello? 16, the number is 16. Yeah, load up! Moving inside. I'm in. All right, I might have something. Single contact! All right, clear as we go. Each apartment, in every room. Stack up. Set. And go! Hostile in the corner. Muldoon up, one infected down. Carla, one hostile down. Room clear! Friendlies, coming out! Go, go! Clear! Clear! Baldoon up, no hostiles, no friendlies. Okay, move upstairs! Oh shit! Ah. Make a hole! Body in it! Oh, look out! Still going! Slinky, slinky, everyone loves zombie slinky. <laughs> All right, they must be hiding. We got a lot of the doors open. Coral, you and me, clear left. Vic, stop, you guys clear right. Muldoon, watch the hall. You got it. Vic, you good? Totally, with you. Go, go! Uh. Uh. Hostile down! One dead here. Friendly's coming out. Go! Same here. Go! Next room. One more. Make that two. Three. Check in the bedroom. Clear. Friendly, coming out! Ditto, on the right. Come out. All right, move up. One more apartment on each side, then target the room at the end. Carl up, no hostiles. Victor up, no hostiles. Both sides. Coming up. All right, move into the hall. (laughs) 
Robbins, reporting in. We made it to the outpost door. All good here still. What about you? Sounded like a lot. This is it. Every room behind us is clear, too. There were a few so far, but we took care of them. <laughs> ah! Holy shit! Ah! Carl! Ah! Damn it! I can't get a clear shot! Ah! Get out of the way! Get off! Get it off him! There's no way to without me! Yeah, don't worry. <coughs> I'm here. <coughs> oh man, just oh. in time too. <coughs> fuck you and the fucking zombie horse you fucking ran in on. Fuck! Good. Get it out. Hey, you okay? No scratches or nothing, right? I'm good. But what the fuck, Victor? You said the room was clear. Hold up, you think it came from our side? I saw it! There's no way, there wasn't anything. Clear. Nothing in the bedroom. Now there isn't, but he missed it. No way! Couldn't have been! Move aside. I know what I saw. Just stay out of our way. You better calm the hell down before I- Hey, shut it down now! All right, we gotta get in the secure room. You two, get to the gun truck, cover us. Gladly. Come on. Easy, man. Let's just get this done. But you better deal with that. Yeah, I know. I just fucking hate pulling rank. Yeah, that's what you get for being an officer. Look, I just wanted to fly. Okay, R. Kelly. Eat my ass, dude. <laughs> no key. Someone's in there. Those things tried hard to get in, too. It took a beating. Yeah, doors reinforced. CJ's idea. It's still locked, right? Yep. Want me to break the lock? Get us in. On three, two... I could just unlock it. Yeah, what is that? My way would have been cooler. Come, come, come on inside. They're here? Come on, come on! You can relax, we took care of them. Oh, we? God. You only shot one. This is the only one that mattered, right? Meh. It's Carl. Oh, hello, uh, who is this? Uh, my boyfriend and I are so glad you're here. Not even two steps into the All right. room, and he's already getting shut down. I love it. Carl. Not, not the time. Seal the door. We got any reason to stay? Infected didn't get in here, right? No, but are you them? Who? The colony in California. Wait, how would you know that? And how did you know where to find this place? The antenna's on the roof. There's a bright green light on the on the base. And, and a Filipino man in Boulder mentioned he came from somewhere around here. One guess who that might be. So you're from Boulder? Yeah, we made it out before the blast. Came to the only place we thought might be left. We started out with uh, quite a few more of us. We'll let CJ deal with you when we get back to the colony. Come on. Wait, why'd you stop responding over the radio when we called back? Generator is out of gas. It was running before we got here, though. All right, wait a minute. Log says Glenn was the last one here. Mm. Working on a surveillance system yesterday. The cameras were still on, luckily. We, we saw them hide and, and go quiet. Otherwise, we might have left. Good thing. Infected are still waiting in the hall. The cameras are still on? Well, they would show that Victor No, didn't... no, the battery went out a little bit before you got here. Damn. S sorry. Good enough for you, Puck? Yeah, I think so. Good. Throw the key back under the mat and we'll get the hell out of here. All right. Grab the DVR there for the cameras. CJ or Tanya might want that. Let me know if it has footage of Victor. I doubt it, for sure. All clear out here. How's everything going? We're coming down now. And don't call a team in the field, Victor. We're supposed to call you. I have never seen Carl so pissed. So we head back to the colony with the Boulder refugees. Wait, that's what Victor did? To not work with the soldiers anymore? That was the straw that broke the camel's back. And it was a big straw. Looking back, I think it was just his nerves, you know? He tried so hard to fit in, he just wasn't focusing on the right thing. Back then, we saw it different. No one on our team trusted Victor to watch their backs anymore.
This way. Can we take the blindfolds off yet? Yeah, go ahead. Oh, your gates, they're beautiful. You guys made these? I'd hardly call it that. They work. That, that's what I was saying. They're well made. I don't want to be the bad guy. You know that. But he's not a soldier. He's not. No, I understand. I do. He doesn't know the language, the maneuvers. I even found his rifle with the safety off in the truck. He's been an accident waiting to happen, and now Carl was almost that accident. I really thought it was gonna be over. Seriously, how many times are we gonna retrain him? And it wasn't Saul's fault. You're, you're sure of that? Positive. Saul's just trying to protect him. Yeah, he would. Next, all hands on deck. Maybe leave Victor behind. Saul and Victor can do whatever they want on their own. We have a tight team. We know what we're doing. Yeah, you're right. You need me to talk to him? No, 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 no. I'll tell him. But I'm doing it after the party. No, oh, that's still going on? Yeah, apparently Datu's 33rd birthday is a big deal. Actually, I'm looking forward to it. It should be fun. I'm pretty sure you got an invite. Yeah, I got it somewhere. Maybe I'll see you there. Hey, hey, it's all good. It is, right? I, I can't... I can't stop looking behind me. That's called life now, man. But, I mean, not like this. Oh, here he comes. You, uh, you say your piece? Yep. I told Michael Victor's a liability. Good. Look, I just, I feel a lot better with just you three. Yeah, me too. Hey, back at you. As long as you're in a moving vehicle. Oh, that's hilarious. Another fat joke. So, when are we gonna talk about the hey, gold? Man. Ow. You don't have to pinch me. Don't say the word. Shh. Why are you all of a sudden so eager? I don't know. I mean... Maybe something today made me think of how much better it might be if if we were in charge, you know? I, we wouldn't have to do these kinds of missions anymore. We could do whatever we wanted. Hmm. Someone else is starting to see it my way. Yeah, your guys are just getting your hopes up. Yeah, I ain't totally sold on it either. Well, we got this birthday thing tonight. Why don't we talk about it afterward? Seriously? You're going to that? Yeah, really. After today, I don't know if I really want to. Hey, why drink your memories away tomorrow when you can do it tonight? Or burn them. Yeah. But honestly, Michael made it seem like fun. I don't know, that's a very shaky source for fun. No kidding. I mean, remember New Year's Eve? Three balloons and a punch bowl? Yeah, I don't know. I heard a few others chatting about it. Apparently, that's who's going all out tonight. Yeah, and it might look weird if we don't go. The whole colony's gonna be there. Fine. I'm in. I don't have anything to wear. I might have something you could borrow. Any ladies coming to this thing tonight? You really think Datu knows any? Doubt it. Watch. There's gonna be like five people at this thing. <laughs> this is not possible. <laughs> hey guys! Glad you can make it! Saddle up, partners! There's hats and boot-shaped mugs over there for you to use. Have fun! Oh, and I, I have an itinerary with all the stuff and times for things. Ooh, yeah! <laughs> no one said it was a themed party. Did anyone actually read the invite? I would have, but I'm your plus one. This says Datu's 33 giddy up and say howdy. Who the hell would come to... Datu! The hot tub is making that weird noise again. I'll be right there. Never mind. How does Datu know all these people? Friends with all the ladies? What is his secret? Datu, thank you again for fixing my generator yesterday. There's no one here like you. Oh, oh that. There's your answer. That, that, that was not... What do you say? Meet back at Robin's in my place at 12? It's not really that clean right now. Well, whose fault is that, Disgusto? Hey, fine by me. Giddy up! Look, I just, I feel really out of place. Because this is like a full-on costume party. Can we please go change? Oh, into what? Our cowboy and Indian uniforms that we got lying around? I barely have regular clothes that fit, let alone a fucking costume. This is just really embarrassing. Hey, Carl, Carl, you gotta relax, man. Just own it. <sighs> Who knows? I might get something for my film. Dude. Record the band. We can use the music later. Whatever. Where's the bar? Hey. Don't worry, Excuse you. Excuse me? That wasn't my fault. 
<laughs> yeah, buddy, look, I stopped, you broke my glass. Whatever, I don't have time for this. You know what? Neither do I! Gee, whoa, 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 what the hell, man? Let him go. Yeah, come go. on, come at me! Hey, Carl! Let's see what hey. you got, come on! What is wrong with you? Let him go! Carl! Get the fuck out of here! What's your problem, man? It was an accident. Go on. Motherfucker. What the hell, Psycho? You wanna see Psycho? Whoa, 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 easy, Step back. easy. Hey, just walk away, water boy. Carl, get over here. What? Here! I got extra mugs. I'm fine, just get off me. Kelly, come clean this up. Whoa, what did I miss? Son of a bitch. Carl was gonna hit Pete. What? Carl? That's it. I'm not turning this thing off for the rest of the party. I'm gonna go grab more tapes. Gold Rush will return after a good word from our sponsor. ACAST powers the world's best podcasts. Here's a show that we recommend. Nature. I've got a gay rooster named Francois. Is so gay. These rams are gay. I'm studying gay animals. Does that mean I'm gay? So why don't more people know this? I'm Owen Ever. I'm Lane Kaplan-Levinson. And this is a field guide to gay animals. A podcast about queerness in the natural world. The animal kingdom is queer. And we are a part. Find a field guide to gay animals on Spotify, Apple, or wherever you get your podcasts. ACAST helps creators launch, grow, and monetize their podcasts everywhere. ACAST.com. We now return to Gold Rush. I knew I shouldn't have come. I should probably just go back to the house right now. Carl, and do what? What, sit around and mope? You've been complaining that we don't do anything fun, and now you want to go home? I mean, come on. How often does that happen around here? Oy. Thanks, guys, but I just... Look, I, don't, I just don't want to be around anyone right now. And I don't think you should be by yourself. So... So why don't I take your mug, you go sit in the hot tub, I'll fill it no, up... No, no, I mean... I... It was probably a bad idea anyway. I, I'm really not the best when I drink. You want to try my stuff? Yeah, I... I, I, don't, I don't know. Wait, uh, what? Your weed? Hey, come on. Shh. Really? What? Look, you smoke all the time. Nobody cares. Some do. I mean, I get it. They don't want me being a little off if something happens, but shit, man. Look what we have to deal with every day. What does anyone expect? We all got uber PTSD. This is the only medicine I need. I mean, does it really help? For some, it just, people react differently. Yeah, I don't like it. Makes me fart. Really, gets my stomach all messed up. You look like you're shaking, dude. So this will help. Ah, guys, come on. I don't know. I mean, what if something actually does happen, you know, and we're, we're attacked or, I don't know, I do something stupid? We got your back. And look, a lot of guardians are working tonight. Every tower. Just don't do it in front of Michael. You don't want this ending up in one of those stupid fucking journal entries. Look, if you don't want to... It's no big deal. Just, it's not for everybody. You know what? Fuck it, let's do it. Okay. Hey, yeah! Good, I already got something ground up for my latest sativa patch. Wait, do you have plants? Where? Yeah, special little greenhouses here and there. When do you even have time to take care of all these plants? All right, all right, stop poking around my business. Here. Really? Just hold this. Really? Is this happening? I smoke it the way I like it. No need to talk like savages here. You know how to use this? Yeah, yeah, I, I know how it works. Just pull slowly on this one. Okay, I should, I'm, I'm gonna sit down for this. Hey, Muldoon, are you sure that this is a good idea? Yeah, he'll be fine. Oh. Well, that was a big rip. Oh, boy. <laughs> I'm fine. <coughs> uh, is he gonna be? Yeah, he should be. If anything, he'll probably just pass out. <coughs> I'm fine. All right. I promise I'm fine. (laughs) 
You're finishing that here? Pegs, Michael, welcome. Come on in. Hi, hi. Oh, um, how are you? Oh, uh, hey, Carl. Didn't expect to see you here. Yeah, last minute plus one. Well, there's chips over here, and I made the world's best homemade guacamole. Carl, we need more ice. I'm on it. He should not have run his own party. Shatu, you should be having fun. I can take care of all this. Oh. Uh, you sure? It's okay. I got this. Excuse me. Coming through. Excuse Clear a path. Code ice. Code ice. Excuse me. I'm sorry. Oh, my bad. My bad. My bad again. Hey, good to see you. Good to see you. Um, okay. So he becomes Energizer Carl. Somehow I think I should have seen that coming. I didn't think Carl could be any more Carl. Too bad he's not trying to punch someone in the face. I'm all stocked up on tapes now. Yeah. Well, the Greens did their job. Yeah. What a weird night. And it doesn't stop there. Is that Michael? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, this is going to be great. Michael, it's a theme party. You have to come dressed up. Um, no, well, not everyone, apparently. I missed the memo. You came as farmers. <laughs> oh, man. See, Pegs, I told you, you're a farmer all the time. Why couldn't we be cowboys? Oh, look around. Everybody's a cowboy. We're doing something different. The hell what these two done think. <laughs> oh, damn. But she's right. Rocket girl. Farmers run this world. Damn straight we do. Now come on and fill my boot with more whiskey. Go on, Michael. Be a nice gentleman and fill that lady's boot with your whiskey. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Good lord. Leave me alone tonight. We spend enough time together. Sure, but I should get some cutaways with you, though. The farmer angle could work. Come on, put that away. Datu went all out with the decorations, all right? A good filmmaker uses what he has, and this is gold. <laughs> okay, just just don't get in too much trouble, all right? Get no promises. Oh, no. Hex! Hey, you're not gonna go film that? Knowing Michael, I'd probably lose my camera. Ah, smart move. I'll catch up with you guys later. I'm gonna take my own little break, you know? Maybe I'll see what's on uh, Datu's little itinerary. What is that? Are we under attack? No, you dumb shit. In here. <coughs> so obviously this section of the party is not themed. Dad too said we could change the movie. You think I'm afraid of you, mad dog? No. But you should be. <laughs> That's right, you should. Why? The things I've done. I think Mad Dog was my favorite villain of the series. Oh, for me, it was uh, Zero. Made my heart stop. Oh, that entire cow scene. That was the worst part, dude. Looks like she should be hanging up. What is this? The Dark Fears 5. What have you done? You remember your sister. <gasps> remember her face? <laughs> remember how it looked? <laughs> Bastard! Get her! Get all her own stunts, I heard. Oh. Dude, Robbins, you can borrow the DVD later. The party ain't in here. I know, but this is like the best part. Oh, I I heard I left the, the generator on it. Outpost 16. Sorry about that. I I must have forgot. But those people found it. Yeah, it worked out, I guess. I've never been so happy to make a, a mistake. <laughs> Gloria is yeah. so hot in this movie. Don't sneak up on me like that. I read somewhere that right. she broke Do her toe yourself. right. Oh. Hey. Oh. That makes a lot of sense when you when you watch her her reaction. Here, Pete. Sorry about her. Oh, thanks, man. Me too. Really? We talked it out. Well, well, when? Oh, hey, speaking of, can I talk to you for a second? Yes, yes, you can. Come on, Robbins. Must be important. Oh, God, what now? Don't threaten me. This way. Robbins, you were just gonna sit there and watch the movie all night. Not the entire time. We were only in there for like three seconds. Oh, yeah. Jeez, man! Dang, Datu even got a horse for this party? 
Giant thing sneaking up on you in the dark? Oh, don't frighten her. She's nice, aren't you, girl? Hey, Muldoon. <coughs> Have you guys read what Dachu's got at this thing? Horseshoes, poker, whiskey pong, archery, free drinks in the cantina. Can we move over here, away from that thing? What? You're not afraid of a horse, are you? It's not me, man. It's them. They have an issue with me. Yeah? Always? As long as I've known them. Okay, guys, guys, look. So, I went to go get ice, and I was, like, thinking to myself, like, you know, I really wish that we still had, like, Arctic Glacier was, like, the gold standard of ice, and so it made me think about the gold again. So then I broke into CJ's library, and I started looking at all of her maps. You what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I, I searched through all of CJ's maps, and I found this exact spot on Route 66 where those guys, they said the truck broke down, right? Remember that? And, and where it gets all windy. Oh, oh, Energizer Carl, he just keeps on going. We're doing this now? I thought we were talking about it later tonight. Yeah, this is great, man. Just stop saying gold so loudly. But, but, but then I started thinking to myself, I was like, well, look at the map. Look, there's the hill, and then there's the shape of the road that matches it perfectly. Like, it was, it was traced over. And that, that dot there, that's a town. Hackberry. Yeah. Yeah, it kind of lines up. And that gold... The bar, I don't think that's fake. God, man! You see? That thing just tried to bite me! It's a equestrian conspiracy! I didn't even hear her coming up. Are any of you listening to me? Do you know what this means? Kinda, but do you want to tell us in a language other than Carl? I think the map and the gold, it's real. There it is. Seriously, back up, Mr. Ed. Hey, hey, Mrs. Ed. No wonder they don't like you. <laughs> the party continues tomorrow with a special air date of Gold Rush. Written, directed, and produced by K.C. Wayland. Starring Brett Newton, Tony Reyes, Sean Lewin, Christian Vieira, Austin Trace, Christy Carlson Romano, Jim Gleason, Otto Sturk, Nate Gies, Elisa Elliott, Glenn Hoffman, Greg Miller, Jay Oligario. Additional voices by Liam Holton, K.C. Wayland, Katie Wayland, Jenny Lynn, and me, I'm Michael Swan. Produced by Brett Newton, Tony Reyes, Sean Lewin, Christian Vieira. Associate producers, Shanti Ryle, Lauren Kroon, Blair Wayland. Casting by David Seidel, Vanessa Knight. Original music by Danny Burkhoff Hopkins. Supervising sound designer, Casey Whalen. Sound designers, Michael Keane, Ryan Lincoln. For more info about the show and a complete list of cast and crew, visit us at www.we'realive.com. We'd like to thank the entire team at Podcast One. As the leading podcast network, they have made it possible to bring this series to life for you. And they have more than 200 of today's best podcasts easily accessible on the free Podcast One app. This has been a Theater for the Mind by Wayland Productions. Dedicated to Nick. In the next chapter of We're Alive. Let me see this map. Follow me! Camera's rolling. I was nothing, you know. Hey, Muldoon, mind passing that lemon over here to the hero? Here we go. Dude, it's totally there. You just haven't been paying attention. Yeah, I'll believe it when I see it. Do we need to watch everything? What does any of this have to do with the gold? We're coming over? Carl, what weird shit did you get us into? Just go with it.